orange flavor, mother. Hello everyone, it's King CK here with the final Washington State Ferry Series video, or well, walkthrough tour video. Unfortunately, um, we're coming to an end because, well, we've pretty much ran out of ferries. Um, I know there's a handful of really old ones, the pe old steamers, which I decided I'm not going to build just because they're kind of a mess to build. So, um, unfortunately, it's the end of a series, but hey, look, we got a whole entire fleet of ferries to show for it, so... Um, today I'm pretty much going to be showing you guys uh, two of the ferries and I'm going to be announcing what the very final video for the Washington State Ferry Series is going to be. So I'll announce that at the end. Um, so today I'll be showing you guys um, one of the, well, one of the most demanded, demanded ferries and one of my personal all-time favorites. So I'm going to be showing you guys the Hayek, which is the Washington State Ferry uh, Super Ferry, which is a, pretty much a souped up Isaiah 130 class ferry. So... All right, let's get started here. So I'll talk while I'm showing you guys, so I can we can cover ground and show it at the same time. So here's Hayek. It's pretty much a souped-up version of Tacoma. Um, it's like if you shrunk Tacoma and then put a second floor on it, you'd have a uh, Hayek pretty much. So that's kind of what I did. Is I I went around and I super like mega edited Tacoma. And so we'll start down here. Car deck is the same as Tacoma, just because that they are very very similar on the real ship. Um, I mean, you're not going to get much difference on the car decks. So we'll go up here to the passenger floor, which the first passenger floor on, uh, I just did the save time on, to, uh, on Hayek. It's pretty much the same as Tacoma. So up here, you just pretty much got seating area. Uh, nothing too fancy. I mean, if you've been on a ferry before, you'll start to realize they all are kind of the same. And looks like uh, Chris decided to put signs all over here. That's great. Uh, here's the cafeteria, which is kind of tiny. I didn't put much time into the cafeteria because I was kind of pressed for time on this ship um, just because I really wanted to get it out to you guys so I can actually start filming on the final video so I mean uh, I said probably in the beginning I said I didn't want to do a super ferry only just because of the two decks but unfortunately due to the high demand I got a lot of people wanting this ferry hang on I'm going to lower my render distance for you guys no I didn't want to download this world um, just so it's not lagging as much while I'm filming Normally I don't have this issue, but I've been, if you haven't noticed by now, there it goes. Gotta love how my mouse doesn't want to go where it is. Um, if you haven't noticed by now, I'm using a HD water texture, so the water actually seems realistic, and I've just been doing that for part of my uh, pictures for you guys. So like if you guys are following OIO, or Operation Infinite Ocean, you'll see a lot more of the pictures, a lot high depth, and a lot more quality. So, um, alright, back to the Hayek. Uh, I gotta clear my throat for you guys so I can keep talking. Um, pretty much what I did is I took Tacoma, like I said, super edited it, uh, put the second floor on, and then up on the top, as you can tell on like the real ship, it's really boxy. This is probably like one of the most boxy-ish looking uh, cut, or, um, bridges out of them all. So pretty much I tried my best to to capture the boxiness of it, which turned out okay. And then here's the smokestacks, which... Uh, out of all my ferries, believe it or not, this one was probably either the easiest and one of my more favorites to do the smokestacks on, only because it w they were pretty simple. Like, they were just straight up curved smokestacks versus where Tacoma over there had the weird ones, uh, Kennywick had the weird, like, up straight ones, and then, uh, Evergreen had the worst, because it has the antenna that sticks out from them, so... Uh, pretty much this these are this was probably my favorite to do the top of because the top on this ship is really really bland uh, So that's pretty much it for Hayek. Um, I'll have a download out for you guys on planet Minecraft hopefully here in the next couple days maybe tomorrow or Friday possibly uh, Just keep checking back make sure you subscribe to my planet Minecraft account and my YouTube account and That's where you can always find schematics for these things. That's where I post a lot more extra info on them and that's just because it's easier for me to post schematics on Planet Minecraft for you guys. Because that way you guys just go to one place and I don't have to upload them to two, both Planet Minecraft and Mediafire. So, um, as it's becoming night, I'm going to have to change change it to day. There, that's a little bit better. So, pretty much that's Hayek for you. Like I said, it was the most, one of the more demanded ferries. I had about four requests for it saying, oh, hey, make a super ferry. Uh, I didn't want to, but I got to do what the fans want and... Of course, it's it is a fair it is part of the series, so 
Decided to build it for you guys, so there's the Washington State Ferry area uh, Hayek. So now we're going to move on to Chinook, which is not an active service anymore, but it was retired in the past three years, I think. And it was just retired um, only because it made too big of a waves and it would disturb the traffic at Friday Harbor. And so they had to retire it due to environmental reasons. So here we pretty much have it. There's supposed to be a name on there, but World Edit hates signs. So, all right, I'll start up at the top and then work my way down. So pretty much you got the control system, which um, looks like we got Len, Len Ed, the builder of the ship here. So, oh yeah, I should probably tell you guys before I start explaining it who built it. So uh, I absolutely am garbage at super ferries. So we had, his name is Len Ed, which is, he's part of our Operation Infinite Ocean team. Uh, I asked him to build this for me. He said, sure. And it turned out absolutely amazing, better than whatever. If I would have done it, it would have probably turned out a lot worse, but uh, he, he did it. It turned out uh, like absolutely crazily good, so uh, I'll give you guys a quick tour of it. You've pretty much got passenger seats here, and then you got a uh, snack bar, which isn't on the real ship, but we thought it would look better if they had a snack bar on it. So there you got, got him serving up, us up snacks, and we are going to go up to the second floor on here, and upstairs we go. Um, just big open space and bathrooms are back there. And now we are going to teleport here um, and show you guys a tiny bit of a preview for uh, for Operation Infinite Ocean. So we moved the Chinook in here. So up here we got, you got the, it uses the same style uh, boarding ramp that I have for the Evergreen State, if you haven't already noticed. <laughs> um, pretty much you board the very like that and that's about it but this is parked over by the marina I think Chris was all like oh there's not enough room but it looks good over here so I think we're gonna keep it over here so um, that's pretty much it for this video I'm gonna quick teleport back to the ferries as he's flinging his meat at us <laughs> uh, so pretty much this is the end of the Washington State Ferry series and so now I'm going to announce to you guys that it's not quite over yet we have one more video for you so if you guys have been following from the start, I I thank you. Uh, I'm glad you guys have been supporting us throughout the whole whole fairy series and watching along with us and all that fun stuff. So for all my and all those people that are even joining now at the end, uh, I thank you guys too, who because you guys are gonna get to see the cinematic trailer, which is going to feature all of the fairies, uh, and it's gonna be it's gonna be amazing. What we're gonna do is we're gonna hook up uh, Zeppelin, and I'm gonna pretty much line up about four ports, and it's gonna be absolutely phenomenal. So uh, check back in probably two weeks for that. Otherwise, just subscribe. Uh, I highly recommend it. Uh, I'll be putting out stuff all for uh, Operation Infinite Ocean too. And also, I know it's a bit of a bummer since the fairy series is ending. Uh, we are, although starting up a new fairy series. Me, George, and I think Len Ed has volunteered to help out too. I'll have to talk to him on that one. Uh, has We're going to be starting the British Columbia ferries. So uh, I already started one that you can go check out in preview three, I think. Yep. Uh, it's one of the ocean, Operation Infinite Ocean previews. So go watch those. Oh, no, it's the uh, Herocraft Farewell video. That's where I showed off. Um, that's one of our first ones that we started, and uh, that's pretty much it. Um. Uh, other than that, I think this is about it. Uh, on behalf of all of the builders and the Operation Infinite and Ocean crew, we'd like to thank you guys for watching. Uh, thanks for subscribing, all that fun stuff. Um, one last thing is I know I'm going to get a comment about this. Before before I get a comment about this, I did not build the Isaiah 130 class only because of one of two reasons. is because one, that both the Super Ferry and the Tacoma are pretty much predecessors of it. And if you really want to, you can just modify Kenny. Kennywick and just take away that second floor of windows and that'll look like the Isaiah 130. Uh, Kenny is way off scale but the problem is we put it at the scale because it was my first ever ferry and we weren't expecting which scales we were going to use so that's pretty much how it started. So other than that uh, I'd like to thank you guys for watching and I'll hopefully see you guys in the next video. Make sure you subscribe uh, for, for you guys watching for Op Operation Infinite Ocean. We will be releasing the map at 20 subscribers, and we are already 10 subscribers in. So, subscribe if you want to get the map. We're going to be releasing. There's going to be a bunch of other vehicles we haven't released schematics for. Uh, all sorts of that fun stuff. So, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Facebook, um, 
our Planet Minecraft or our Minecraft forums page, and uh, that's pretty much it. Thank on behalf of uh, Infinite Operation Infinite Ocean Crew and the uh, Washington State Ferry Build Minecraft Builders, uh, we'd like to thank you one last time. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next one.